Hello well, and, and welcome. welcome. <laughs> Today, Today we, we are, are going to draw Cat in the Hat. That's right, and you're dressed up like Cat, cat in the, in the hat. hat. I think that looks really <laughs> pretty cool. And that's like a cat in the hat makeup. And you got the makeup on. Yeah, it looks really awesome. You can't see it, but she's got a little cat a tail there as well. Yeah, very good. All right, there we go. All right, so I hope you follow along and uh, have lots of fun. Uh, but before we get started, we're going to need a few uh, drawing materials. We need markers. Markers to, to draw with, yeah. Some paper to draw on, uh, and then something to colour in with. So We can need markers, yeah, oil to... pastels, crayons, paint. Yeah, anything you like. Or markers. That's right, we like to use markers. Yep. All righty, so you ready to go? Okay, let's go. Alrighty, so we're going to draw a cat in a hat, so we're going to draw... And it's going to be a bit tricky. Yeah, it's just going to have lots of detail on this, but it's going to be lots of fun. So we're going to draw a, a big hat and then the cat's head. I'm going to draw his bow tie there as well. Alrighty, so you ready to get started? Okay, so first of all, we're going to draw his ear in this area here. Um, so we're going to draw a little line that goes like that. That? Yep. Like... There. Yeah, very good. And he's got a little bit of furry bits and then we're gonna draw another line which is the inside of his ear. That's right. And then just along that line, we're just gonna do a couple of lots of little lines like that. Because he's a cat, he's a little bit furry. Furry, not a little bit furry, a lot a lot lot lot, 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 lot furry. furry. Alright, so now we're going to draw his hat first. So we're going to draw the rim of his hat, so we're going to draw a line that goes down here like uh, this. A tiny bit curved or a tiny bit diagonal. Yeah, and it curves around like that. Yeah, and then we're going to draw another line around it, so it's got some thickness to it. There we go, and you just want to draw that on the behind the ear there as well. The, the, the rest of the hat sticks out behind there. Okay. Alrighty, now we're going to draw the rest of the hat. He's wearing a stripy red and white top hat, so it's really tall. Now with the cat and the hat drawings, they like to use lots of wobbly lines, so it doesn't have to be completely perfect. You can do lots of funny different little lines. So you can make it lots of fun. Oh, so it's just he's got a top hat that's very tall. And so like a sock. It kind of does look like a sock. Yeah, it doesn't have to be perfectly square or cylinder shaped like a normal top hat. Because cats and hats are funny character, so he's always a little bit funny looking. Yeah. Uh, and then we're gonna draw some lines. So now cat and hat, he's actually got five and normally he's got five stripes on his top hat, so he's got uh, three red stripes and then two white stripes. So we'll just, just draw them along here. And again, you don't have to do perfect lines because it's always funny to do it a little bit wobbly. There we go. Good job. There we go, it's looking really good. All right, so next part, let's do his Face. Oh, it this... looks a bit weird. We just did the hat. I know it's just a floating hat, but now we're going to draw the head and draw yeah. all the other details. So we only did a tiny bit of the head because mm. we did the ear. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So we're going to start at the top here. I'm going to draw his forehead, and it's just a little curved line like that. Yeah. And then we're going to do the top of his mouth, which is another kind of curved line that will go around here like this. It's like a free, but it's the opposite. Yeah, that's right. Good job. And then at the end of his mouth, you're going to draw it like a little curve there. That um, is his, his cheeks. All right, so now at the bottom, we'll draw his jaw. So it's another, it's kind of a U-shape, isn't it? Yeah. Like that. And then another little line here as far as his, sort of his chin, I guess. Okay, so now we're going to do the other side. We're going to do the back of his head. 
Now this one here is quite furry, so you can do it. Well, not tricky, it's a little bit furry because he's got, he's a cat, so he's got fur. So you can do all little curves like that with little jagged edges. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, and then we'll go down a little bit further for his neck. I've already done that side, and we'll do one on the opposite side there as well, like that. Alright, so this is time to take shape. So let's yeah. do his eyes next. Eyes. Yeah. Alright, so we'll do two ovals oh, here. Those? Very good. Then we can put another circle in there. That's right, so we'll put some more ovals in, in the middle. Then we can yeah. colour the big circle in. If you want to, yep. Yeah. Now, the cat in the hat has um, actually got lots of eyelashes. So we'll draw some eyelashes on top there, like this. And one on the bottom as well, a little bit. Yeah, and he's got some eyebrows. Uh, we'll do that one at the top here, like this. Now it's go. time to do the nose. I think so, yes. He looks a bit funny without his nose. So let's, <laughs> let's draw his nose. So another, his nose is again like a nice oval shape there. Kind of like a little grape or olive. And what I, I'll do is I'll colour half of it black like that. I coloured all of it black. That's fine, you can do that. Alright, now the cat is also got some whiskers as well. So what? what about the tongue? It looks so weird. Okay, so well, let's do that first then. Okay, so draw his mouth. So we've done this U shape here. And then we kind of follow the shape, but a little bit smaller like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then in there we can draw his tongue. Like that. I put a little line. Oh yeah, awesome. Okay, can we do his whiskers now? Yeah. Let's do his whiskers. So he's got two on each side. So we start on here and they're quite long actually. Stick out like this and then another one like that. Yeah, very good. And next to that, yeah, we'll do them on the other side as well. Again, they're quite long whiskers. Just like a real cat. Okay, and next to the whiskers, we're just going to put this, he's got always got two little dots there. I put more. Yeah, you can do that if you like. Okay, and I think the last bit we'll do is he's got a really awesome red bow tie. Yep, that's like me. Yeah, you're wearing one as well. So let's draw that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start off with doing a little bit of a circle there at the bottom of his neck. Yeah. And then we're going to do a bow tie sticking out the other side. Again, normally we're going to do bow tie, we do a triangle shape. But again, he's a, he's a silly character. So, yeah, we'll do, it's, I don't know, it's kind of a one, funny, wobbly shape. So, we'll do it that side. And then there's just a little line going out there like that. Yeah, we can do it. We'll do it both on the other side. Like that. And I'll do another line there. Yeah, and he's, actually, he's got one on the bottom there as well. That hangs down like that. Yep. Okay. So there we go. We've got Cat in the Hat all drawn up all the lines. And then the next step is to... to colour! Colour in, that's right. So we're going to fast forward this part. We'll be back very soon. <laughs> Okay, we're, we're back. back. <laughs> we're back, yes. And we've coloured in our cat in a hat, and I think it looks really wonderful. We've done the traditional colours with uh, black, white, and red, but you can really colour it any colour that you like. It's really up to your imagination. Uh, you can add other details in there as well. I can see that you've added some shadows in there to give it some more detail, so it's really awesome. So do you have fun? Yep. Okay, well we hope you had lots of fun and if you enjoyed this video make sure to check out our other videos as well. Uh, but thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you again next time. Bye! Bye.